good and bad, right and wrong. We often assign these labels to our experiences, thoughts, and feelings, creating a sense of duality in everything we encounter. But what if we let go of these labels? What if we could see everything as part of a greater whole? By removing the label of good or bad, we start to understand that all experiences, whether challenging or joyful, serve a purpose. They are here to teach us, guide us, and help us grow. The so-called negative aspects of ourselves are not our enemies. They are just as valuable as the positive. Our fears, doubts, and struggles are there to help us become stronger, more aware, and more resilient. Both the light and shadow aspects of who we are are necessary for our well-being. When we embrace all aspects of ourselves, the part of us that dreams big and the part that feels fear, we become whole. This integration is essential for manifestation. The left brain, often associated with logic, structure, and analytical thinking, must work in harmony with the right brain, which governs creativity, intuition, and emotion. When these two sides are in unison, we can use both our rational mind and our intuitive wisdom to shape our reality. If we rely too heavily on one side, the logical, practical mind, we may miss out on the inspiration and flow that come from intuition. On the other hand, if we live only in the realm of creativity and spirituality without grounding ourselves in action, we may find it hard to manifest our desires in the physical world. Both are necessary. The left brain helps us build and organize. The right brain inspires us to dream and create. Together, they give us the power to bring our visions into reality. Now, let's talk about the physical and spiritual aspects of life. We live in a 3D world a world of material objects, physical sensations, and everyday experiences. It's easy to get caught up in this physical reality and forget our connection to the spiritual realm. But the key is balance. We must learn how to enjoy the beauty and pleasures of the physical world while staying connected to our spirit. When we find this balance, we can fully experience life in its richness without losing sight of our higher purpose. It's important to ground ourselves in the present moment to enjoy the wonders of this physical life. At the same time, we must nourish our connection to the spiritual realm through meditation, reflection, and aligning with our inner guidance. Balancing these two aspects allows us to live with purpose, joy, and meaning without feeling disconnected from either our physical existence or our spiritual nature. This balance is often described as the harmony of yin and yang, the dual forces of energy that exist within all of us. Yin represents the feminine, receptive, and nurturing energy, while yang represents the masculine, active, and assertive energy. Both are equally important. When we balance these energies within ourselves, we tap into divine power. Too much yang can lead to burnout, stress, and aggression. Too much yin can make us passive, unfocused, and disconnected. The true power lies in balancing these energies, knowing when to take action and when to allow when to lead and when to receive. This balance fuels our manifestation abilities. As we harness the masculine drive to create and the feminine ability to flow with the universe. Ultimately, the goal is harmony. By aligning our left and right brain, embracing both the physical and spiritual aspects of life, and balancing our yin and yang energy, we create a state of inner equilibrium. From this place of balance, we have the power to manifest our desires, live with purpose, and experience life in its fullest expression.